effects of work ethic. Every employee has a work ethic. Most people don't think about whether or not they have a positive or negative work ethic, and even less people think about the effects of their work ethic. An employee's work ethic can affect that person's career advancement, the overall atmosphere of the workplace, and the quality and amount of work that is accomplished. Let's first define what a good work ethic is. R. Ladson Berry and Robert E. Glenn, co-authors of the book Teaching with Excellence, suggest a list of qualities of an employee with a good work ethic. This list includes being ambitious, committed, efficient, having a good attitude, being honest, obedient, and versatile. I would also add a few more specific qualities, such as being to work on time, not calling in sick unless you are legitimately sick, and not doing personal things during work time, such as taking personal phone calls, text messaging, or checking personal emails. Let's assume that a bad work ethic is the opposite of the good work ethic just described. A bad work ethic will have negative effects. An employee with a bad work ethic will not be respected by fellow employees and more importantly will not be respected by their employer. This could result in little chance for career advancement and may even result in termination. When this employee moves on to a new job, it is unlikely that their employer will give them a good reference if they had a bad work ethic. A bad work ethic will also influence others. Kiki Herford, a columnist in Dynamic Chiropractic, wrote in an article in 1997, a serious side effect of these attitudes is they are contagious. I've seen offices so soured by bad attitudes that more than one person eventually had to go. A negative work effect will also decrease productiveness. On the flip side, a good work ethic will have a positive effect. An employee who has a good work ethic will be valued by their employer and most likely respected by fellow employees. This will result in promotion within that company, and if the time comes for that employee to move on, it is likely that they will receive a good reference from their former employer. Just as a negative work ethic will have influence over others, a positive work ethic will also have influence. You may even inspire others to improve their own work ethic by setting a good example. An employee with a good work ethic will be more efficient. Therefore, more work will be accomplished and this will result in increased revenue for the company. Both positive and negative work ethics have effects. A bad work ethic will have a negative effect, and a positive work ethic will have good effects. I would assume that most employees want to be respected by their employer and want to advance their career. Therefore, all employees should take the time to think about their work ethic and the effects that it has.